Šta radiš, David? Um, these are hazelnuts and all these hazelnuts are from the garden and we're shelling the hazelnuts so that we can, or that you can, Tam can, make um, lots of nice Christmassy type desserts. And I like want... Like hazelnut cookies. Like hazelnut cookies indeed. And, and... I think, I think in England we call these pork scratchings, but they're called pork chips here. And it's the nearest thing to an English beer that I've got. Stout. So, cheers. Zivio Milan. Mm -hmm. This will take us a few hours because there's... How many grams do we need of this? <laughs> I think I have three recipes, 700 grams. 700 grams. It's very, I was saying to your dad just now, it's very, very therapeutic doing this for the whole morning but this yeah, is yeah. nice these are from our garden from our garden yeah grach what goes in grach pasta pork leg mm -hmm. um, beans beans and bacon not the pork leg it's the bacon beans vegetables oh and the meat is smoked pepper, smoked, meat. smoked meat smoked meat yeah. smoked meat yeah like i put these like a bacon bacon we're going to have this tonight, aren't we? Yeah, today for lunch. Busy old busy making grach and sorting out Starting to make the hazelnuts for Christmas. Because I don't want to do everything in the last day. <laughs> You've been drinking. Because I'm making a lot. No, because I'm, <laughs> I have been drinking, but I'm not drunk. Because I've been making a lot. I'm going to be making a lot of food here. Here's the list. Okay, read it. I'm gonna make one, two, three, two, three, four, five, six types of cakes. Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna have bright snowflake. We're gonna have like a mezza scones, pigs in the blanket as a starter. And then we're gonna have the main course. It's gonna be like a chicken soup or something with uh, baked uh, pork meat, like a pork ham. But uh, done our way because you cannot gammon, Doing, baked we, gammon. But we, yeah, not but but our style. Uh, your style, because yeah. Because you cannot buy uh, baked gammon that we have in uh, that you have in England or I don't know in England, I guess. And then I'm gonna make rolled pig, which is gonna be done with the bacon meat, like a, uh, a rolled uh, pig stomach. Yeah. And then carrot and crumpier, which is carrot and potatoes. You meant belly, you meant belly pork, didn't you? Belly pork, yes. Yeah. And then Brussels sprouts, and then from all of this, you're gonna make gravy from all the juices from the meat. Can I do the can I do the potatoes? Yes, David's gonna help. Now and can we have honey roast carrots as well? Yes, we have a recipe from the waitress. What's the name of that store in England? Waitress. Waitrose. Waitrose. They have a great book. David got one year for Christmas. Yeah. With a great book of recipes. Okay. Okay. A basic Saturday lunch, some nice pickled vegetables. This is grach with um, some smoked pork meat and uh, Kreinska sausages inside. <clears throat> that is a German beer. This is karamut rakia bread pickles. Look, 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 like, look, look at me, at the look, look me, look is at the, the look. Look is the word for... Look is the word for the onion, but it means look, like look in English, and you don't have graha without look, not in this country. Maybe English people like that, but look goes well with chevap and grah. We are Tamara and David, an Anglo-Balkan couple who live in a village in beautiful northern Bosnia and Herzegovina. Here on our channel, we take you along with us during our daily lives and also to the places we discover on our trips away. From everyday life to culture and food, we'll show you what it's like for us living in this much misunderstood country. We're looking forward to you joining us. Remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. Hello and welcome back to the vlog. Um, this is the last one before both Christmases, 
So you should get this one on Christmas morning because we do schedule it. Yes, we always schedule it. <laughs> so it's a bit of a difficult and different vlog. Difficult because, well, it's very personal at this time of year, so you don't want to have cameras in families' faces all the time. I don't think that's very good. You can still film the food. Yeah, we're going to film the food and we'll put that um, in on another our vlog. next vlog, yes. And it's After Christmas. And it's different because... Yeah, COVID this year has made everything a lot different. Um, I haven't even been able to get back to the UK this year to get any supplies. So there's no mince pies, no Christmas pud. But yes, but, I'm, bring back. but uh, these little hands are making special food. So yeah, we're going to have a special Christmas. So some of the things that you've you will see in the vlog. You so made some biscuits. Yes, I made some biscuits and I made stollen. Today how, how difficult is it to make stollen? Pardon me? How difficult is it to make stollen? It's not so difficult at all. It sounds difficult, but it's not. You just have to let you just have to let the dough rise a lot, and uh, it's easy. Well, I used it now; it's very good. I was quite surprised about the roll of marzipan. That is marzipan that you put in the middle. Yes, by original Dresden recipe, the marzipan goes in the middle, and you're supposed to make it half a lard, half a um, uh, butter. But the recipe I found in a book it's very good, and it's just only with butter. So those are all the sweet things. Yes. What are we going to have on Christmas Day? I mean, we uh, won't be filming this because this is being viewed on Christmas Day, on my Christmas Day on the 25th. Off the top of your head, what have we got? Uh, we have got, uh, we're going to bake a, a big lump of pork, like a prosciutto, how do you say? Ham, like yeah. a pork ham, like a leg of the leg of the pork. And we're going to do rolled pork as well with the prosciutto and pasta sauce, which is uh, like a bacon. A stomach like a pork stomach and uh, I'm gonna open it like a book and then I'm gonna roll it and it's gonna be nice you will see in the vlog and uh, I'm doing potatoes roast potatoes honey glazed carrots honey glazed or soya glazed car carrots and one of the things that I'm really looking forward to uh, we were gonna use brie <coughs> but we're going out shopping um, and I'm going to buy a big camembert and what's it called what do you call it a rosette a camembert rosette or a camembert wheel camembert snowflake it's called. <laughs> camembert snowflake Yes, but I'm going to make it differently, because I don't like the taste. You don't? So anyway, you'll see what we're having in the next vlog. As I say, this one is just to say um, Christmas wishes. Um, and in the next one as well, you'll see how the fence project has been coming on, because I didn't think putting the fence project together in Christmas was the right thing. So, wherever you are in the world... Have a very nice Christmas. Do stay Happy safe. Happy New Year. Do stay safe. This, stay safe. This is our first COVID Christmas, isn't it? Keep distance, yes, and hopefully last one. Last COVID Christmas. First and the last COVID Christmas. Hey, are we going to be wearing masks while we eat? No. It was a bit of a joke, actually. So, from us here in Bosnia-Herzegovina, in the village, to you, wherever you are in the world, once again, please stay safe. Have a very, very merry Christmas if you're celebrating now. If stay with your family, don't celebrate with friends and a lot of people. No, and stay if, safe. if you are of an Orthodox Christian persuasion, then uh, you can wait till the 7th of January and we're going to do that all over again, aren't we? Yes. So that's it. So you're going to have two Christmas vlogs this year, like every year. Like every year. Okay, we've got to get cracking, we've got to get into Banja Luka to do shopping now. So um, yeah, while you're watching this, please raise a glass to us because I think at the time that you first see this, we'll be laying the table. Yes. Yeah.